Dear friends, on this day, I will thoroughly explain the detailed process required to upgrade our Harmony OS 4 system seamlessly to the latest Harmony OS 5.0. Also, how to downgrade from version 5 back to 4. During yesterday's live stream, many friends realized they still didn't know. Then, I'll explain the entire upgrade and downgrade process. For those of you currently on Harmony OS 4 and want to upgrade to 5.0, you can take a look. First, we need to register to perform the upgrade. Start by opening My Huawei. Then on the home page, there is an upgrade station option. Open it. All right, let's proceed. You can now directly register your device at this convenient location. The registration will be thoroughly reviewed and promptly approved, typically within approximately one to two days. Then we can access the settings menu on our device and proceed with the necessary steps here. Just refresh and it should download the version 5 package. And I must emphasize that you need to back up during the upgrade. During the upgrade, you'll be prompted to back up. There are two methods. One is cloud space and the other is local storage. If it's insufficient, we can use cloud backup. You must back up. When we downgrade the system, we can restore this backup. After upgrading, to learn how to downgrade your software as well, open our settings menu and click here. Then find the software version section in the settings and we can proceed. By clicking it repeatedly, it will prompt you to restart. After restarting, open settings again, scroll down to find system. Carefully scroll down the settings menu until you locate the developer options within which you will find the available system downgrade feature for making changes. Here you can perform the downgrade. This is the entire method for upgrading and downgrading. Note that you must back up when upgrading. When we downgrade, we can restore those backups. However, after upgrading from 4.3 to 5.0 on 5.0, be aware that all data generated will be lost permanently upon downgrading. It is important for everyone to remember this fact. Therefore, those still using version 4.3 who wish to upgrade to 5.0, we can attempt the upgrade. And if the upgrade proves to be successful and ensures that all software systems continue to operate without any issues, then it will eliminate the necessity for us to perform a downgrade. All right, everyone can give it a try.